What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Tony D2Wild, checking in once again. Tony Digital bringing back another 1440p visual. Back with another banger today, guys, Um, on a very uh, upsetting video, man. You united, I'm going to say united, you untied Hawaii. You shout out to the homie, man. He's actually one of the guys I showed you guys before about the mystery box stuff that was going on with Pretty Boy Fredo. He actually, and whoa, the fuck? I thought I was, what the hell? Um, he just dropped the video saying I have to sell my sneaker collection and I thought this was pretty bad He actually dropped this a day ago and I have yet to see it The reason why I wanted to react to it today though is one I want to see a sneaker collection, but two I'm about to end up selling my sneaker collection now. I don't know Not not the whole thing. You get me like I'm about to downgrade it When we I'm, I'm waiting basically to do the sneaker collection video itself You know the one that I told you guys for five years now. We're dropping that in December we're shooting it in December. I'm letting everything get clapped, you know, up. And then we're going to do that video. And then I think in 2021, we're going to downsize a little bit. Um, let me let, let, let go of some stuff, man. Because there's just things in the closets that are collecting dust at this point. And they're not going to get worn. They haven't been worn for three years. So what makes you think that they're going to get worn in five, six years? You know what I'm saying? Like, what I figured and what I'm starting to see about myself is I wear sneakers that are in my realm of reach if i can't reach for if i can't grab it i'm not gonna wear it like i'm not gonna go downstairs in the closet or go down to my garage and go grab a certain sneaker to, sneaker to wear there's certain shoes that have to stay though because they're grails but there's a lot of shoes that can go a lot of shoes i picked up this year i was looking at the jordan one lucky greens i'm like bro they're nice but i think they can go so i'm about to start just letting stuff go man off the rip i want to sell them lucky greens right now but I wanted to get I want to do a sneaker collection video when I have all my stuff on deck and then I want to let stuff go so it is what it is if I can't get my money back if I get bare minimum uh it's fine you know but I'm downgrading definitely in the 2021 because I'm going to end up buying stuff again in 2021 it's not even like a a regret or I'm giving up it's just like bro I'm going to buy more shoes like I've been selling shoes right but I get so many in that it don't even I'm still plussing I'm, I'm selling 30 shoes. I'm like, yes, I downsized. And then I get 50 shoes. So it's like, I'm really just, I just gained 20. So, you know, it is what it is. I want to see what Untie has to say though, man. So before everybody freaks out. And we're going to leave a link down below in the description to his channel as long with this video. So you guys go check it out. But I can tell he's about to say exactly what I'm about to say. It's not over. I mean, obviously freaking out because it's not in like the normal like place where I'm like. Oh, never mind. Um, the title of the video was me talking about selling my sneaker collection. And no, that is not clickbait. I'm not selling my entire collection per se. I'm trying to sell about like half of it without exactly. going into it like too in depth because it's kind of like personal stuff. Uh, basically, like I'm okay. I'm perfectly fine. And that's mainly thanks to you guys. Um, with the whole like pandemic and lockdowns and stuff happening, obviously, like everybody's been affected like in different ways. Some people have been like put on unemployment. They don't have a job to work at and whatnot. But for um, myself, because of YouTube, you know, you can still do YouTube at home, and uh, that's all thanks to you guys. So thank you guys so much for continuing to like watch the videos, support the videos, liking the videos, commenting, and basically just letting me like you know continue to live my life normally. So that's good. However, the reason why I have to sell my salutes to Untied and salutes to you guys on YouTube for allowing the same thing for me as well. You know, what I'm saying that's the blessings of YouTube. Um, fortunately, and hopefully, it continues is because uh, unfortunately I have family members and stuff who are not as I guess blessed or in a position where I am um, where you know they could be working the entire time and I, like I said I don't want to get too personal but basically I need to help out like family members and stuff and I realize like sneakers and stuff is cool and this like whole collection and whatever is nice you know but you know family's forever right and shoes are just shoes and like I can sell these shoes and eventually hopefully down the road when things do get better I can always get them back that is the number one thing that I have been putting in my head, trying to fight my other fight. It's a sneakerhead head and there's a smart person head. Bruh, if I sell a shoe, like I've sold a shoe that I regret selling, a Bel Air 5. I hate that I sold that. The original one, right? Bruh, real talk though, I can go get that shoe right back. It's $500. I can go buy it. I have $500. If I really wanted it and I needed to wear it, I can go on StockX right now and buy it. But it's like, no, I don't. Like, I, I, I want it, but I don't need it. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's the difference. That's the thing that really matters about this stuff that you start realizing. Want and need are two different things. And you don't really need any shoe, but you get the point. Like, 
Like, do I miss my Bel Air 5s that I sold? Yes, I do. But do I miss them enough to go spend money on them? No. If there was a Bel Air 5 right now for retail, $250 or $200, I wouldn't be quick to go spend that $200. I'd rather spend $200 on the Jubilee because I'd rather get that and review that. That's more important is getting out the content to you guys and going to get a shoe for a personal matter. You know what I'm saying? That's just what it is what it is at this point. That's how I look at this stuff. So I'm sitting here thinking like lucky green ones, they can go. Fearless ones, the patent joints, the red, blue, red, white, and blue ones, I love them, but they can go. I don't know. Maybe they maybe they can stay. They're all patent left. They look they do look kind of good. The fight. The fight. That, that's important and you need to do that in the now so that's why i'm like selling like a lot of my collection uh, not necessarily all of it but a lot um because i have to help fund and you know like support family so yeah i'll be going over all the shoes that i'm selling today and i will be selling oh. them on my website on typeaway.com and those are going to be for the channel members well hey be, like all the membership that untied hopefully i can help promote your shit for you and get you some sales brother <laughs> Woo. hopefully i can help you get some sales man you watching this video? Look, I'm gonna move myself out the way, man. Untied Hawaii, okay? Dot com. Go cop. Help my brother out, man. Did you guys sign up? I thought he was finna show his collection before it gone. Like he's about to show what he's selling. Stuff and you guys, you know, you we'll go to the web. We'll go to the website after and check it out. I figured, you know, trying to go through that route so that way we can make like a little bit more so I can get to that family member. And all of the shoes will be a lot cheaper than it would be like anywhere else. Like whatever the lowest price on GOAT is for a similar shoe, it's going to be cheaper than that. And uh, I'll be flashing the numbers on the screen of what I'm going to be selling these shoes for. So that's where most of the shoes are going to go. Sign up if you guys want to be channel members and support. I'm not asking you guys to do it. It's just that that's where the drop is going to be. Anyway, let's get into this sad video of me selling my shoes. So <laughs> I've had a hard time figuring out what shoes I'm going to sell because I do really like shoes a lot. You know, I love shoes. I have like this whole like... You ain't selling them Yeezys though. You ain't selling them Yeezys. When you actually like try to get into your sneaker collection and figure out what you want to sell, man, it is tough. I guess we'll work from left to right and... Man, I just had I just realized I had this, had this thing down the whole time. Hopefully, hopefully it wasn't too low for y'all. Let's go. This is like, I'm doing this with you guys because I'm not sure what I want to sell just yet. Unfortunately, I think these are the first ones that have to go though. So this is... The calls are gone. Like my pair of Jordan 4 Cause. And honestly, like a really good shoe. Uh, I really like this one. You want 1100 1150 god damn I want a lot you guys obviously know i have like a lot of cost t-shirts i got the figurines over I'm gonna go here look and see but again it does have a sold. lot of good resale value and i don't really wear these things too often either that's the other thing that i want to talk about too is like when we're in this like lockdown and stuff i swear i've worn <laughs> like maybe three or four of the shoes from the collection in the entire year just because we're not really going out right so even more so it just made me feel like what's the point of having these like things in my house when I could turn it into money and you know help support a family member instead so that's my thinking and this is one that I haven't worn like so I think this one is gone I think this one's sold out I'm on his website right now you have to be a channel member though so I don't know if I don't know if he I don't know if these are like all I don't know it's something weird you gotta yeah I think you have to be a channel member so I can't even tell what the hell's going on okay yeah Oh, uh, okay. All of 2020. I think the last time I wore it was like in 2019, last year. So even more so, I'm just like, okay, I got to get rid of this. It is something that I do really love, but the cost for got to go. So this one is going to be on sale on the website, on untitleway.com. I'm sorry, cost for. We got we to gotta part ways, man. I do love this shoe, though. It's, it's pretty depressing. Oh, well. Hopefully down the road we can get this one again. And okay, this is the next one that's got to go. And Mari is actually the one behind no. the camera filming right now. Mari, are you, are you okay with me selling these? Oh, yes. <laughs> no, not the guys, man. Six seventy nine. <laughs> Damn, I bought mine for $300 back in the day. I'm happy I bought that back then. <laughs> These are so cool, though. I always like this pair. This is the Sean Weatherspoon Air Max 197s, man. You guys know what it is. It was sneaker of the year, I think, Don't in 2018. Do it. And I honestly really like this shoe, but Mari says that the rainbow stuff doesn't really match with a lot of things. And, yeah, she doesn't see me wear this one very you can rock it with that tee you got on right now, buddy. Don't do it. Often either, Don't so. do it. Another one that I do like, and I think it adds a lot of nice color to the collection and whatnot. And it's just a really unique shoe. But Mari, is, can we, do we sell this one? Yes. 
Mari, right, come okay, on so now. This will be on the web store too. Man, hey, this is so hey, Mari, you and Nikki would get along. I could tell. Cause see, that's a, that's that Nikki stuff right there. Yes, Nikki would make me sell every goddamn thing in here if if it was up to her. Bruh. Nice though, don't let you, don't let you don't let your lady help you sell shoes because you'll lose everything. Whatever. Okay. So we got the cause and the weather spoon ones. Uh, next up. What about, what about this? Can we, what is this? No <laughs> way. Can we? Yo, is that a Nikita, bro? Is that a Nikita? I'm looking that up. That's a Nikita, right? I'm looking at, is, I'm trying to think, is that a Nikita? I, I can't, I don't know if that's a Nikita, the face. I'm looking up Akita to try to see. It looks a lot like it, but nah, it's like a, it's, it's a, it's, I know that dog's face. I no might be way. wrong. No? No. Looks way. like an Akita. Put him down. <laughs> but it's for families. How much would you guys pay for this thing? None. He's not for sale. <laughs> no I think those dogs way. are pretty Just expensive, kidding. though. You yeah, might try to get okay. some good flips out of that. Just kidding. We never get rid of you, homie. You, you are family, man. You are family. Okay. Uh, so yeah, Kuma's not for sale. Sorry, guys. I know you guys were looking for that hot ticket item. Okay. This is another one. We gotta get rid of the off-white blazers. Now, Ooh. I really like this sneaker. And honestly, as much as I like this one, like... The $8.99? Damn. I ain't gonna lie, them other prices was kind of high up. That's a low price right there. Them things going for about a... I mean, dead stock too. They going for a lot. You you might them them. Let me see them going for. Whoo, let me see off white. Them things are going for some bread, bro. They don't look that bad. Con the condition. Them calls look like they would put some work in them. Y'all can sell these right now. They going for seven. The last sale was seventeen hundred. Damn. That was on November eleventh, seventeen hundred. But they going for right now. So you can sell it on stockage right now for nine 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 for a rack. But. Bro, yeah. I mean, that's decent price, but they going for more than that. And that cool, that's a good con condition, in my opinion. The more I realize, like, it's, it is kind of plain, you know? Like, I feel like a lot of the off shoes you. are not yeah. super, super, like, intricate. And this doesn't have as much, like, sentimental value, per se, as, like, the cause for... I might need to let mine go, in all honesty. The only sentimental value that shoe got for me is that's the last off-white I hit on. Shit, the last good sneaker I ever hit on on goddamn on uh nike because they on that they be on that bull that bullshit to me or it's not even as unique as like the sean weatherspoon so i this is actually one of the ones that i was like you know for sure i could get rid of this one just because it doesn't speak to me as much you know it doesn't have like a sentimental place in my heart it's just i might let mine go now that you say you're wearing but yeah those are replaceable now we're dipping into the jordan ones and Ooh. man this is I really don't, don't want do to get it. Collection, but I gotta do it. Jordan Damn. ones, not for resales in the red colorway. And you're reselling and dude, them. All of my shoes. This is the thing. All of my shoes are immaculate. Like everything in the collection, they're not super like beat. Like if you guys look at the quality of this up close, look at the creasing. There's like barely any creasing on here. Leather is still super super buttery. It says like not it's just for immaculate resale, on here. Bro. And I mean, like I'm saying, I just wear my shoes very cautiously. So it's just everything is in really. Them calls you didn't wear them costly though, brother. You was you was rocking them. Them motherfuckers got them had a little bit of. I don't know. We might have to hit you off. With, I might have to send you some of my sneaker cleaner to get them things cleaned up. In nice condition. So you probably will not find better you shoes on the market. Those are good. Yeah, everything mask. else is good though. This yellow one though, just because you guys know my thing with yellow. And also, I know you don't. guys are thinking like, okay, what about these top air you you shoes? I can't do it. I can't. Okay, all right. Because I was gonna end this fucking video right now. And I was gonna, yeah, I was gonna end this video if you would've did that. We would've had personal beef. Just relax. Can't do it, man. I yeah. will do whatever I have to do and I will sell all the other shoes if I have to, if I have to, to support my family. But this <laughs> is my last resort. Like these are literally like my grails. It took me forever to hunt down all of this. I, I just, I can't get rid of these for now. Them, them gold joints though, them never released, right? Those aren't symbols or chat. What is those, those gold ones? Are those customs? So. Sorry guys, the Air Yeezy 2s are not going to be for sale right now, but um, yeah, those aren't going anywhere. Obviously, can we get rid of these? No. No? <laughs> well, <laughs> you creased it. I did crease it. <laughs> you guys gave me a lot of heat for that. Oh, so he, okay, so he, that, that's what's up. So he proposed in them. Shit, what did I propose? I proposed in my goddamn socks. Damn, I should have did, I should have got some, I should have put some damn shoes on. Eh, the creasing's not 
not even that bad here. So I'll just show you guys really quick. This is the canary dunce Damn. that I proposed to Mario with. And uh, it's the infamous shoe that I creased really bad. Because, I mean, you gotta get down on one knee to propose to your girl, right? So uh, it doesn't look too bad. So as much as everybody was flaming me, still a wearable shoe. But I can't get rid of this yeah, sentimental bit, value, right? Yeah, so I feel you on that. That one's staying here. I will be getting rid of these, which I didn't even have a chance to wear. And that's another problem that I mentioned with the whole lockdown things and stuff. The shoes that I wanted to like wear and like undies this year, there was no time for me to undies them. Like, Hawaii's been in and out of lockdowns like since February or whenever it was. So. There really hasn't been like a time to like, oh, you know, actually wear your shoes outside and stuff. So these Brazil Dunks, as much as I like them and, you know, I talked about them being like Packers colors. I'm a big Green Bay Packers fan. I haven't worn them. I mean, they're still like brand new dead stock. So this that, is one that I think it's the, 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 uh, the Brazil joints. Them. There's no sentimental value. I actually made a whole video about me copying the Jordan 1 breads for the <laughs> Don't do the press. That's the OG. You like you want the easy two. You gotta. I mean, they, they might restock them or whatever. They might re-retro them. But come on, just keep those. You can get rid of all the other ones. You gotta keep the original OG, the Dun Dodders, the Dun the Dun Diddies. Jordan one bands. Um, because people were flaming me that I didn't have them in the collection because they're a very classic shoe. I beat the shit out of mine. But in that video, I talked about his dude the look, fact that I his actually dude like, like, like the red toes and stuff a lot his, better than the bands. Oh just man. Because I don't know, it has more color diversity, and I know this is like an iconic shoe and whatnot, and it should be in your collection if you guys can. I don't know, man. I can, I can, I can live without this one. This is not something that I'm super into. And when you guys look at this, I mean, dude, this thing is like basically dead stock. Like, yeah. come on, man. That's man. basically DS. There's nothing wrong with this. So. That's another one that I have to unfortunately get rid of. This is tough. This shoe right here, I can get rid of. Not super Pine expensive. Uh, this is the Jordan 1 Pine Greens. Should I get rid of this, actually? This is a shoe that I, like, I have a separate job, like, uh, I guess a super, super side hustle. I'm not sure if you guys know this. Did I ever tell you this? Um, basically, what I do is I work as a instant replay technician for the NCAA for um, the UH men and women's basketball team. So I used to wear mm. these to the games like every single game just because the UH Warriors, their colors are like green, black, and white. So I mean, green, black, and white, right? So I used keep to wear them, this to every single them. game. And at one point, they were lucky. I don't think we lost when I was wearing these. But then they started losing, so it doesn't have any like effect anymore. But I do really like these. They're UH Mineral colors. <sighs> okay, these are these are up for sale. Woo! My heart, my heart. <laughs> Wifey so said you put them on there. Put... Yeah. All right, you got some Travis ones and Unions. I think there's some Hyper Royals, and I see Shattered. You can pass some Shatters up, and oh, you got two Unions. Don't let me keep these though. Did you ever see these in person, Mari? No. What is that? Sean, they're two one. different colors. Yeah, so they're basic. This is the same shoe as this, the Air Max 197s, but this is the uh, A6 version. Sell it. So, okay, well. <laughs> Those are nice, but yeah, make your money off them. The, the A6, they crumble, bro. I mean, I didn't even get a chance to undes these either. You guys can still see the tags and stuff on it. So, put that yeah, bit on stock X. Sell this, I guess. Okay, so I think this case is done. What is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight shoes. Ugh. I think I'm gonna get rid of these. I'm actually Whoa! Don't do it! Come on, bruh! The they fuck? Talk about these re you let, bruh, take them damn unions away and shit, man. Get rid of them goddamn unions. Recently, if you guys have been watching my secret oh Mr. my Boxes, god, we got like one or two of these in. I really have like a personal thing for the Tiffany SB Dunks just because this was like yeah. the first shoe that I found out about back in like 2009. Please, when my, come like, on, uh, bro. College roommate was telling me like, hey man, there's these crazy like Tiffany Dunks and stuff. They're like going for like 700 bucks. And I've told this story a lot, but um, I was like floored. Like $700 for a pair of shoes for me back then was like ridiculous. Like I told you guys I came up on like pay less shoes and like really like <sighs> discounted like foot oh, stuff. And, like my most expensive pair of shoes I think was a pair of running shoes that I needed for track and field. It hurts now. It's starting to hurt so now. Now it's starting to hurt. A pair of $700 shoes was ridiculous to me and now these go for like over a thousand. Um, so I was really happy when I got them in the collection but I realized I don't wear these very often just because I was like so scared to wear them because I don't want to like ruin them. So if you guys look at like the condition up close like the leather there's dogs around here we'll get rid of that. But like the condition of the leather and the stuff on the toe box is really nice. Unfortunately, like with all Tiffany Dunks, the swoosh is like a little bit like, I, I don't know how to say it. Like oh, not really shit. peeling, but it's like, has like a bubbling effect. It's weird. The fuck? I got the, dun the Dunk highs. I need to see if my shit do will do that. And that's with everything, but everything else on the shoe is really nice. Gotta get rid of this one just because I don't wear it. So it's 
gotta go. I think that's it for now. I, Mari is looking at me right now like, you gotta sell more. She always wants me to sell my sneaker collection, but... You're not I, alone, brother. I don't know, man. Like, for now, I think this is good. I. What my goal basically was that I wanted to raise like five thousand dollars or so, so I can help this family member out, right? Like they're they're sh they're struggling, and uh, I'm I'm in a place where I'm I'm not doing like super super good, like hey, obviously like, uh, YouTube like hey. money and stuff is down, like yeah. sponsors and stuff aren't as uh they're not paying as much as whatnot yeah. during the lockdown. So um I'm not in a super you great sleeping? spot. That's why I need to sell some of these shoes, but I'm in a better spot than they are. So I got to sell. This is gotta sleeping? be five chain shoes. If we're not, then I will like put other shoes up on there. I won't talk about it in this video, but whatever you guys see on the web store, like when this video goes live is what's for sale. So make sure you guys go check that out. Um, again, thank you guys so much for the support and stuff. If you guys are copying these shoes, know that um, yeah, when you man. guys cop these shoes, you're supporting not only myself, but you're supporting Yo, my Yo, definitely endeavors. go check out untiehawaii.com, but you gotta be a member on his channel. So I'm gonna leave a link down below to his, 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 his uh, like, YouTube really channel. Thank you you guys, guys become a member over and, there, you know, like, and then you can jump in on this drop. Just to support Cause it's not it's like a you secret know, like, link or something that, like that so i'm gonna leave a link to it down below that Become really a means a lot to me um you guys are literally like keeping me kuma delilah mari like afloat and stuff because um you know you support the channel like if you guys stop watching that basically means that i have no job so thank you guys so much for that i'm gonna get them yes, stop talking uh but thank you for supporting my own personal family mari my my dogs and an extension so you, thankfully, like uh, other family members and stuff too so that will be going live. I'm not sure when the channel members drop. It's always like random. So Join just keep right an eye here. out for that. I will have all that information there. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. Really like a uh, different video. It's the first time I will I'm leave a link down below like, in the description to his channel where you guys can join and become a member soon. if you want to get in Let on this thing, man. Um, so Musa on time and hopefully I can help. Probably give him an extra view, give him an extra sub, give him an extra membership. And I respect what he's doing, man. Salute to him, man. I love y'all and I appreciate y'all as well. But yeah. Triple upload today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me let me know you guys' thoughts and opinions. Is he is he is he is, he, is some of those needed to chill or he gotta do what he gotta do? I feel him, but there's a couple of don't do it's in there, man. But yeah, guys, I'm out. Peace.